Hi guys, it's me Swastik and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a system where users will be able to change the prefix of the bot in their own servers. So in theory, every server could have its own prefix. So let's start. So before starting, I'd like to say that I'll be changing the name of the channel to swas.py. It's because most of you guys said I should do it. And if you want to participate in these polls or join giveaways, you can join the server. The link will be in the description below. So let's start. Now. If your bot is in a lot of servers, I'd say you don't do this because it's using JSON files and a better way to do this would be using databases. And I'll be making an updated video about this as well later. But for now, I'll be just showing you guys with JSON. So if your bot is in not a lot of servers, you can watch the video. So we'll be first importing JSON and we will make another file and we will save it as a JSON file with these brackets. I'm just gonna call it prefixes.json. Now, once this is done, we can actually start the code. So the line that we need to change is this line. As you can see, command prefix was set to a single character and this would always be the same. But instead, now we will set it to a function that will give us the value. So get prefix, let's define the function, get prefix. Now the parameters are client and message and inside of this we'll open the file with open prefixes.json as in the read mode as f we will load it so it will be prefixes is json.load f now then we can finally return the prefixes the string value of message dot guild dot id so this is how we'll be storing it in the json file and this is it so now we can make the functions for actually changing the prefix so one event that we should have is the on guild join and in this we'll be just saying that when the bot joins a guild it'll set the default prefix so i already have some i have the code written down and it's simply opening the prefixes or json the same as this and it's setting the prefixes string guild.id to the default prefix so you would have your default prefix right there and then it's just dumping it so it's in opening it in write mode and then dumping json.dump prefixes and f so this is the uh, on guild join so when the bot joins it will set the default prefix and then just store it back so let's now i also have the change prefix command already written down it's client.command I made it so that only administrators can change the prefix and it's simply async def change prefix ctx and prefix we'll open the file it's again the same we'll open the file then we'll say instead of setting to the default prefix we'll set it to whatever the change prefix is and then we will dump it again and finally the on message inside of the on message event we'll say that if the bot gets pinged we will tell the prefix so it's simply if message dot mentions so this is a list of mentions and we can get the first mention if that is we can also get the id i think maybe we can compare the ids or we can just say if the message dot mentions is client not class sorry client dot user we can then say await message dot channel dot send dot send um, my prefix is My prefix for this server is, let's just use a f string and let's have a prefix because we haven't really gotten it. So let's um, open the, again, it's the same as this. We'll simply open this, paste it here. Um, what we're doing is opening this and then we set the prefix equal to we don't have the guild, it's message.guild actually. Message.guild.id and this should give us the prefix. So this is all the code and that's it. And if you want the code, actually when the video hits 30 likes, I'll post the code in my server so you can join there and also hit the like button. So let's save this. Now finally you want to have this await client or process commands and the message so this will be it for the code 
and this will allow you to get a prefix uh, means change the prefix for each server so on when it joins it'll set the pre default prefix and when the, when an admin wants they can change the prefix as well and when the bot is pinged it will give the it will say that my prefix for the server is the prefix so let's test it okay so we need to do this actually we need to put this in a trial try and accept block because if there are no mentions it will actually just never execute the code so try and accept we can pass i guess and one more thing you'd like to probably have it send this saying await oh, cdx.send the prefix was changed to the prefix was changed to um the prefix so prefix and there should be an f string so now we can test it i'll just invite the bot to uh, two servers and we'll see so i invited the bot to two servers now let's check i will ping the bot and as you can see the prefix is the angular bracket let's try to change it let's say change prefix to something like this question mark and as you can see the prefix the prefix was changed and if i try to say it again and as you can see the prefix is now this i can change it again to something different change prefix to this comma and as you can see it was changed but now if you try to do this here it will not be the same though if i ping the bot this place as you can see it is um it is still this angular bracket and not really changed and if i try to do this with this change prefix it won't work as you can see it did not work but if i do the same thing back in my old one as you can see it will work so that's it for today guys i hope you enjoyed if you did hit the like button and subscribe and i will meet you in the next one goodbye